this is it. We're done. This is my third video tonight because I just didn't think I'd be able to do another one. I work a couple days after, after tomorrow. This is it. This is the last video of Junk Wax May. The Trump coin decided last time to do a different box. The Trump coin sucks. So we're doing this. We're looking for a Mickey Mantle autograph. And we will do Junk Wax May next year. Who knows? Next year, maybe the last year. One or two more years, I'm not going to be doing this shit. Not that I'm 50 in two years, but I'm not going to be doing this shit, acting like a fool when I'm 50 years old. So um, we will do Junk Wax May next year. Score, Series 2, 1991 Major League Baseball. Looking for a Mickey Mantle autograph. They really wanted to sell these cards, so they put Alvin Dark on the box. Okay, let's open this up. This was purchased from uh, Burbank Sports Cards. Just in case that needle in the haystack, I, God damn it, pops up. I want Burbank Sports Cards to be the one to, to cry. I'm sure they're doing fine. Okay, let me throw this away. And if you saw the last two videos, it's the same night. We're drinking uh, New Belgium Voodoo Ranger. Just going for it, man. Just going for it. We got the uh, garbage, the garbage baggies. We'll just take these out. You know what? We've been taking them all out. Let's just do one stack at a time out. And um, I'm not even going to tell you what else could be found in here. We're looking for the fucking Mickey Mantle autograph. Don't know. Maybe we would retire if we found it. A ton of inserts in these. And I don't. I think I have two sets of these. I don't know why I decided to get a second one. But this may be the most... If, you, if you've watched my videos from the beginning, this may be the most uh, junk wax gear and series I've opened up. I think I just need a couple, uh, and nothing in the first bag, a couple of these to complete the second series. So we will see. And they have a lot of rookies, they have a lot of base, and I got nothing in the first bag. Okay. We'll try to do this somewhat quick. Thank you very much for watching Junk Wax May. I know it's hard to watch sometimes. I mixed up a little. I mixed it up a little bit. I'm not that drunk. There's Roberto Alomar. Speaking of that, in the last video, you should, if you watched this, you would have saw 1991 Donruss Series Two, the green one. I think it's Series Two, but the green ones. I needed four cards to complete it. Let's see. I got all four. I needed a Roberto Alomar. Right once I got the Alomar, like the other three cards came in the next ten cards because of the collation. So yeah, fuck you. Hand collated. I don't even know what I need for these. I'll have to check. Hand collated 1991 series two Donruss. Yeah, I'm the man. And this card's been made fun of more than I can imagine. And Robbie Beckett. Okay, Chet Lemon. So I don't mind these cards. I vote, like I said, I think I have opened up more of these than anything else. I used to get these a lot back before the boom. These were pretty cheap. There's a Cal Ripken. There's Tim Costo, unfortunately. Randy Johnson. I need two of the uh, Ninja Discs. To, I don't, like I said, I don't remember which ones. To complete the second, second set of the, there's Randy Myers, a very thoughtful Randy Myers. Mike Lieberthal had a nice career. There's a Rifleman, Ken Griffey Jr. Best card so far, I think. Nothing wrong with that Cal Ripken. Like, these are all mass-produced, so... I understand that if any fucking douchebag out there, I'm sorry for cursing, if any guy out there say, oh yeah, these cars, whatever. Yes, I understand that. We're looking for the Mickey Mantle rookie, but since the odds of finding it are low, we need to talk about what we do find. Hey, another Mike Lieberthal. Nice collation. I understand these cards suck. 
They are better than 1991 Donruss. And I'm pretty sure, Robin Young, pretty sure the Trump coin cursed both boxes. Sorry for the vulgarity, but I've had a couple of the Voodoo Rangers, so anything can go now. I feel sorry for the guy trying to break into my house right now. Roger Clemens and a bunch of guys that, oh, it's around there, that I never hope to hear their names again. I like the set, or series two at least. Series one, there's nothing in there. There's another Alomar. Oh, there's the Griffies. This card is very common. They do not have my favorite Griffey, Craig Griffey, no relation. Oh, there's the American flag. Very nice. I wonder if those are in the same pack. They may be. It's pretty well centered. Well, no, it's actually not, but who cares? Do we have this not centered? Yeah. America, fuck yeah. Seriously, if you don't like it, why are you, you know, why are you here? I'm not going to get into politics. When I know that I'm retiring, then we'll start hitting the politics hard. There's another King Griffey Jr., the Rifleman. Is that the same card? Yeah, as you can see, I've been getting, like, the pack, and then two, one or two packs later, the same collation. That was stack one. We are now on stack two. We are looking for the Mickey Mantle autograph. There may even be a Mickey Mantle set in here that's probably also pretty much impossible to pull. If that was Roberto Alomar, I was going to crush it up. And there's Steve Carse, Jose Canseco, Master Blaster. He was a Master Blaster, all right. What else is going on? There's Sandy, Todd Zeal. I just, I just the franchise. Why would there be three franchises in the same thing? Why? And there's the third King Griffey Jr. Rifleman. We're barely into the second uh, stack. I'm not complaining. It could be an Efren Valdez. I think I just made that name up. That I have three of already. There's Barry Larkin. I'll take that. Robin Yount. Ricky. Alan Trammell. I don't collect Trammell, but it's all famer. So it was a nice pack to get and some rookies. So it's a nice little uh, change of pace there. So this should be it for Junk Wax May. Like I said, we'll be back next year. I think next year, hopefully, I can find some type of uh, way to stream. So I can do something live and do like six boxes at once or something. I'm not smart enough to do it on my own. I'll need help. And there he is. Look at that chipper. That's one of the cards we're looking for. Left to right looks perfect. Top to bottom looks perfect. Let's look at these corners. That may be like a PSA 10 chipper. Seriously, shout out to Joel Barry. We have a PSA 10 Chipper Jones. I'm going to set that to the side. It will not be sent in, but I'll know that it's a PSA 10 Chipper. Okay, that's the card that we wanted in the set in terms of other than the big hit. Hopefully we can get one or two more Chippers in this. Wade Boggs, very nice. Larkin, Wade Boggs. Nobody. Joe Girardi, very good. I think Joe Girardi was an underrated, uh, un, not an underrated player, but underrated manager. He was what he was for a player. There's Barry Bonds. I'll take that. And there he is. And there's that American flag again. So we got a Sandberg. I may need a second one of these. That is fucking sweet. Sandberg right there. Another American flag. I will take that. Those colors don't run. Unless you put water on it. Yeah, but, um, 
don't. They don't run. There's shirtless Ricky. Is the shirtless Pucket in this? I don't remember. There's Pucket, but, <laughs> but he's not shirtless. There's another Griffey Jr. It's been a decent box so far. A lot of Griffey Jr. I didn't even look in here. Olerud was a nice player. There's a George Brett. I think the last time I opened this, I got like five of these. But that was a long time ago. I have not opened this for a long time. I used to open a lot of this, whether it be on camera or off camera. The only other one I think that I opened more is the 91, or is it 92 Upper Deck? I'm shocked I can't remember what year it is. And that was a bad bet. And last pack, second stack. So far, like a lot of good, maybe just because I haven't seen this product for a while and that chipper still looks really good. Like I'm happy with it. There's a shirtless pocket. There's a shirtless pocket. It haunts him even in his grave. Rest in peace, Kirby Pocket. Great player, great player. Move on, rookie prospect. I'll take that. And Joe Kramer, I will give that away. Uh, not much else in this one. Okay, we're going to the third stack. We still got it. We still got time. We still got time. We can still pull something crazy. I'll take another chipper. And we have the King Griffey Jr. The third different King Griffey Jr. Dream Team. So, uh, I mean, these are dollar cards. This stack is falling. Frank Thomas, shout out to Mr. T. Haven't heard it from you for a while, Mr. T. Let me know that you're still out there doing good. Mr. T don't need to be good. Mr. T just needs to be all right. Mr. T don't need to respond to lame ass baseball card openers. Okay. Uh, Carmelo Martinez. He kind of used to look like my best friend Mark. Mark wasn't Hispanic, but there's that card again. Dan Wilson. There's a no-hit club. Mark Langston, Mike Witt. Another Joe Girardi at the end there. Yep, I used to uh, call Mark uh, Carmelo all the time. Barry Larkin again. Benito Santiago. Robbie Beckett, unfortunately, for the second time. A big on Kevin Moss a long time ago. And this is about halfway through the third stack. I'm not giving up hope yet. There's the straw that stirs the drink. There's Dave Justice and Sandy. Robin Yao, I think we see a lot earlier. And Robbie Beckett for the third time. Can't give me a second chipper. I think we got time for one more chipper now. And hopefully it stays like it is and the cards are centered. Because I would love to get one more centered chipper. Once again, I'm not saying it's that valuable. It's just nice to have. What is, did I turn it on? Another King Griffey Jr. <laughs> Frank Viola. King Griffey Sr., Mike Lieberfall, for like the third time I can't talk. And I think that's the fourth Rifleman, King Griffey Jr. I'm hoping that I get the two discs that I need out of here. Oh, I'll still buy it. I'll still buy this uh, these boxes anytime. We're going to do this until we find... Until we find a big hit. Money doesn't matter. I'm, I'm not rich by any means. There's Nolan Ryan. I think that's the first Nolan Ryan of this box. But uh, we're going to find. I don't care about buying one. I care about pulling one of my own. There's Dave Stewart. There's the Bow Breaker. 
I actually still need to pull that bow and pads card. I have the football one, but nice bow breaker. Oh, we got a moth. And there's the chipper. Did I see the chipper? I don't know. I thought I saw the chipper. Oh my God, I just had a hallucination of the chipper. Or I caught it from the vision out of my eye up front. I thought I saw another chipper there. This Voodoo Ranger is really messing with me. And there's Ricky. Ricky. Kirby again. Ah, I'm knocking these stacks over. We have to go for a third stack. Last pack, third stack, speaking of. Usually, well, for 91, I can upper deck, I can do two stacks because they're so paper thin. There's a Clemens. Oh, there, I'm missing something. It was the Ninja Star. Okay, last stack. Nothing, well, the old rune, nah, nothing really for me to to uh, keep the box for. Sometimes I keep the boxes. Like if it's a Sandberg, I can cut it out, but. Move on, we saw that earlier. Pretty much probably saw all these earlier. Come on, give me something, God damn it! I think I've earned it. I'm a bad person. I talk bad. I act bad. But I think I've earned it. There's Alomar. Roberto Alomar upside down. Dream team. I don't know why I kept that. There he is. I earned it. The Sandberg Big Head. I probably pulled that card myself 50 times. Probably gotten it in Sandberg lots another 50 times, but. Greg Briley, we just saw that card. Kurt Schilling should be in the Hall of Fame. Pretty sad for the Hall of Fame. Not a fan of it. Like, it used to be that, you know, you was a good player and you didn't break any baseball laws. Now it's a good... I don't mean to be political here. I'm not really political on this at all. But now it's you have to be a good player and be liberal. There's Barry Larkin. We saw the same collation before. Ron Walden. Come on, give me at least one more chipper. Pretty bad when you start asking for a dollar card. Schilling deserves to be in the Hall of Fame. Tony Gwynn. There's Todd Ritchie. Looks like kind of a different collation. Van Slyke. Even the third stack's falling over his I give up, Voodoo Ranger. I give up. There's Wade Boggs. We saw that one time earlier. Tim Costa. We saw that once or twice. We are down to three packs. We're hoping for a miracle. The two American flags is interesting. I thought that was like an SP. There's a Tony Gwynn. We just saw that. There's a Sandberg Big Head. Another Tim Costo. God damn it. Clemens. Second to the last pack. Thank you for watching. This is the last video of Junk Wax made. Uh, before, I'm going to have the Panini Golden Age. I think it's 2014 if I remember right. 2013 I think was the better box. Which I may buy like $10 or $20 more. I may buy that too. And uh, didn't, maybe another box of Big League. I really want to open um, 2020 Tops Archives. I never opened that back in the day. I got one box that was sitting there forever. And then, of course, whatever we find, you know, at the store or at the LCS. So June will be a good month, too. Ricky. Ricky. Dan Wilson. Friend of Ricky. Nolan Ryan. And we're down to the last pack no way there's anything good in this pack so once again thank you very much and uh, I think the next video will be me adding more cards to the yeah the next video will be me adding more cards to the uh, the May giveaway stack 
you guys suffered through this this month for anybody watching me. So I appreciate it. I'll add another card or two. I think this, I'll have to add like three cards and then we'll do, um, we'll do the, uh, what do you call it? The, uh, where you get, put all the people in there. I don't know. I can't remember. Okay. Another Howard Farmer, Jeff Conine. I think that's the first time seeing that if I remember right. And an uneventful last pack. And thank you very much for watching. So a, a lot of decent cards in this, but nothing huge. We looks like we got the PSA 10 chipper. Uh, so I'll talk to you later. In the next video will be the some more giveaway cards. Uh, we'll give we'll do the giveaway, and it'll be a lot of fun. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Thank you. Bye.